game, this. ladies and gentlemen. Hype game is one. Real. Game one. Here we go. Dropping into North with TNG versus Shiki, or I'm probably going to refer them to, to WFSDL at some point during the match. Yes. And That's somehow, of the clan tag. oh man, how did my oh man, my mods are all screwed up. Oh well, we'll have to make okay. it work. Okay. And I'll, I'll work on it in between games. In the meantime, let's talk about the lineups here for TNG. Looking at Montana, Ohio, Yoshida Mosk with double Stalingrad, double gearing, and a Marceau. Talk to me about the Shiki lineup, Seth. So Shiki is bringing two Shiki Shimas. I wonder if that's the reason for their clan I, tag. I, I love it. I wonder, yeah. I wonder if that's the meme. And then double Des Moines, a Colbert, which is interesting in itself, a Yoshino, double Marshalls, and a Shimakaze. So they are going for hard, like, flank, HE spam with Shikishima to just smack whatever they want. Right. Right. All right. Well, looking early, we can see that the, the triple destroyer build for um, TNG, they're sending one to each, one to each uh, cap circle here, getting a look at that early. The uh, the other team, this is uh, Shiki. All they're kind of very focused on this eastern flank with their destroyers. Excuse me, western flank with the destroyers right now. Yeah, and I'm not sure why Arxi and the Yoshino is uh, so far forward. Um, he just took a couple of broadside salvos. He's got another one coming in. Hmm. Now, there's a new mod, ladies and gentlemen, that allows us to detect if if a ship has been detected. It, it gives you that little exclamation mark. So uh, we know that, for example, Penguin with the Hoogie in the Montana just got slapped a little bit. He's we know he's detected. Uh, we also know the Des Moines uh, and 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 one 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 two is detected as well. But you know what I see? For me, that's not working on the red team. That little mod is not working on the red team for some okay. reason. Hold hold your tab key. Tab. Um, and then you should have a settings uh, icon on the top left. Nope. I believe. No. Nope. Okay. Um, All right. Well, I'm not. I'm going to have to work on getting that mod installed before tomorrow. Today, what's going to happen when game one is over? I'm just going to go back to my regular mod setup because this is going to best with me today. Um, yeah. And we're just, I'm going to have to live without that mod today. I'll have to rely on you for spotting info today. No big deal. We'll survive it. No worries. Penguin continuing to get whittled down there uh, in the middle in his Montana. Now and look the, at look at. Oh no. Look at Prometheus. this Prometheus. Yeah, Prometheus is getting, is, is, out is here. getting, getting robocop here by this Marceau. Seawolf's Marceau right up in his face. I'm wondering, can they have, they have a radar handy? The Des Moines, he might oh, be in range of the Des Moines radar. Supreme. Let's see, can they yes, see him? They yes, can, they yeah, can. yeah. There we go. The oh, yeah, plenty of radar. Yep. Prometheus is going to lose his yep. ship here for his trouble. A bold play at B, but it's going to cost him. There he goes. First blood going to Shiki with a pushing a Marceau all the way up the four line there, catching him on the big back side of the cap. Now, that's an aggressive play from Shiki, but it does mean they're going to surrender the A cap and the C cap. In fact, they don't have anybody on the C cap side of the map at all. That's correct, but it does allow for Shiki to push into A now, almost unabated. They, they're they on the, the strength of that one extra, uh, the ship went down. Now, look at Penguin with the Hoogie. He's down below 50% yep. and continuing to drop because he's on double fire. Oh, there's a DCP. Yep, puts Still, the fire out. You know, you know well, he's the farming target now. Well, he has to be. The Colbert hasn't let up at all. The Colbert and the Marceau. The Marceau has no shots. Seawolf's Marceau hiding in that gap up there, using the gearing smoke. Doesn't have shots, but you know the Colbert is continuing to to look for these. As Penguin takes a shot at Moist Mars at Moist Des Moines, that's actually could be a good shot. Uh, yeah, he doesn't it could have been worse. Doesn't get much out of it, but the Shikishima, that's Pocket Medic, solves that problem and ends Penguin's game. That's right. That's right. So now we are down two ships for TNG. Um, and Shiki up two ships. As you can see, Shiki now is like, look, A cap, it's open. I, I guess I'll just sail through it. Yep, wide open now. They've gone, they've gone super heavy Ooh. on the west. And you know, Zap, look at, go ahead. Look at num, look at numbers one eighty six. He's now the farming Ooh. target as yep. he's going to go down momentarily. Yes, he is. There it goes. That's it. Done. Three ships out in less than five minutes here for TNG two. Shiki just all over them like white on rice. Yeah, yeah. You know, Zap, I was going to point out, we one of the things that we've seen uh, in the international bracket of King of the Sea, some of the Russian teams, 
play a mm -hmm. very lopsided strategy on North, like this, right? They, I've mm -hmm. watched, I've, I've seen the RU teams really just heavily push this Western right. flank on North like this. We don't normally see this out of NA teams, but it's what it seems to be what Shiki's doing right here, and it's working out brilliantly for them. Into Sit has oh, just yeah. has made a huge critical error over here south of the C cap. He's broadside to a Des Moines and is oh. Stalingrad, and that oh. is never a comfortable place to be. No, that's uh that that's an that's a big oof right there. I yeah, think I'll do he, another death pick. He absolutely turned right into that island and just T-boned it in perfect position for the Des Moines to punish him. And this is this game is all shicky. We're under haven't even we haven't even played six minutes. And TNG2 was down four ships. Well, we were worried about being behind at the start, but I think we're going to be ahead at I, the finish. I, I, don't <laughs> think, I don't think that's going to be a problem, at least at this in this first round, Zaf. Right. Now, now for my... Oh, go ahead, sorry. No, I was going to say, T, I mean, I don't think that TNG can recover from this. When you Once you've lost no. this much firepower, it becomes almost impossible to stay in a game, right? They've And, and, and the low yes. ship, the low ship on the, the Shiki side is is Seawolf's Marceau and they've they're rotating him back. Like they they don't even want to give up yep. a ship. They're they're going for the flawless victory here. But TNG yes. does have the opportunity to cat to, to claw back a couple of kills maybe if things go their way, but it's going to be a tough it's going to be a tough challenge. Oh, absolutely. Um and keep in mind just because TNG2 has lost or will, will probably lose this game doesn't mean that they're out of the tournament. Uh, there are no. still plenty of battles left today for them. They have uh, what another 7 more to go. Yeah. Six more to go. Six more to go. Now, the Des Moines Moskva duel in C, the Des Moines is starting hmm. to turn his turrets, but I think that might backfire on him. Yep. The Moskva has already gotten one turret in cap on him because you're taking away yep. that frontal armor from the turret. He there. He just got yep. a he just permanently destroyed one of the Des Moines front turrets. So Yep. We quad see that. quad in here is gonna go out soon, right? Like he just doesn't have the firepower left to to, to mm -hmm. deal with this Moskva, but I don't think it's gonna matter. TNG, he's going yep, for the we're ram. About to see a ram. He's trying yep, to survive to, to the ram. ram. If he can survive to the ram, that'll be a huge additional win for Shiki. It's going to happen. Wow. Oh, oh guys, wow. we just saw a ram in the first battle of wow. King of the Sea. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. And Op for Medic in the gearing is being chased down. He's... I think I'm going to set up for my death pick. Yeah, this is going to be in a minute. <laughs> in a minute, Saber Sharks Yoshino on the one line is going to be the last surviving TNG two ship on the board. There it goes. Just like Piranha's feeding here, Shiki is all over Jeez. TNG2 here. Less than eight minutes to basically total annihilation. Yikes. I love that video game, by the way. I have never actually played but that yikes. game. I have never oh, actually played game, that great game. game. I mean, we don't have the game timer right now. That's something else where you yeah. guys are going to miss this entire tournament. The mod that allows us to know how much longer is in a game has been gone for two patches and has not come back, guys. So... We're going to be a little right. a little hamstrung in that department over the course of the tournament. Um, it's but it's two seconds per cap, so you're going to have to do some math and right. You know, but you know, you're, you're, you're basically once a team crosses 900 points, the pressure is on, is what it boils down to, right? Saber Correct. Shark knows this is over. He's he's not really broadsiding to these guys, but he's not really like making a huge effort here to to, <laughs> to save his ship. He's he knows this is oh, over. Yeah. He's hoping he can take this Des Moines with him, I think. Well, and remember, the sooner the game ends, obviously, the sooner they can prep for the next battle, the sooner right. they can start talking about what worked, what didn't work, what they can change in their lineup, and et cetera, et cetera. So. Yep. Now, Yoshino's armor is absolutely capable of holding up to this, to this Des Moines until the Des Moines gets on his broadside. His bow armor will angle okay. Mm -hmm. Yep, see, his belt armor took all of that. But I think at this point, yep. Moist Cake is going for the ram. He's getting full pins in the bow now, as they might... Ooh, good hit on the Marceau. One more rack of torpedoes. Could he get, he could he get, could he get the Des Moines? Uh, no, no, no. No, he doesn't. Ram denied. The dance. Ram, ram denied, but what a dance. Ram denied, but this game is all shicky from pole to pole here as they go up 1-0 here in group play on day one. What a battle. Wow. Congratulations to Shiki from Indeed. Uh, for advancing. Woo! That game was short, bloody, and violent, Zath. I mean, th there's there's only one thing I have to say about that. Are you not entertained? Woo! <laughs> you Seriously, know, like, right? Are you not entertained? 